Hello everyone, welcome to In Production. So today I brought you here at Kawartha Lake. That's right, the Kawartha. It's the same name as the famous ice cream company here in Ontario. Actually, they have a factory here, even though we didn't visit. Their vanilla ice cream is really good, I can tell you that much. Anyways, I'm now here about all by myself. I actually came with two friends. That's Jeffrey. And that's Aaron. Say hi. Thank you, sir. Hey, I just squinched my face. Actually, the Jeffrey's parents live here. That's how we came about to be here because uh, we were invited, both Aaron and I. Hello. <laughs> oh, it's your. <laughs> I have to go this way so that Lake is coming into camera. So obviously the lake is a big thing and there's a lot of cottage houses, big houses. So not only within Canadian, uh, but also from stage, a lot of people come here for relaxing summer vacation. But because of the pandemic uh, is going on, I guess this year is much, much quiet. So I'm at Kawartha Lake I'm right now with my two buddies over there. Um, so I'm at a water lock. So if you see it, water is higher on this side than this side. See? Uh, it's kind of hard to see on the camera, but it's higher. Let's go. As you can see, uh, this part is higher water than this part. It's really hard to see. But... Yep. So that's Bob. That's Jeff's father. He's a photographer too. He has a full frame. Uh, 400 mil zoom lens he's testing it out so all three was following him a, a lot uh, around not only because he has the car but also because he's a good photographer he knows where to take of good photos so I might be able to get some nice colors from that though. and we did I took two of my favorite shots right here in this location. Oh, yeah. I really love the calm water reflection of the sunset with the purpley cloud and atmosphere. There's a lot of um, stumps and things coming out of the ground over there, which is kind of neat with the reflection. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that should be fine. It's starting to get dark for my lens. Oh, they have the sour ones. How's that one? Yeah, that one's got a little grab one. That's awesome. That up. Gimbal's off. We're flipped here. We're flipped. Well, you're not taking my picture, are you? That's a video camera. <laughs> this is what I want. Are you waiting for me to dance? <laughs> no, what I was going to say is I bought all these like handheld stabilizers and this and that, but that's the, the common thing now. So you guys are making like, a... It makes oh, look at it. It moves smooth. by itself. Yeah, he controls it with this. With my oh, wow. finger. Well, the idea of it is when you move around, your camera doesn't shake like this. Yeah. That's the whole idea, right? In the town, there were a few really nice looking classic cars. Um, this one happened to be parked, so I grabbed some pictures and videos. Garage in general, like people leave shit around and then I think it's theirs. No, no, yeah. Last night I, uh, what is it? What is it? A, a bird. Bird? Yeah. This big? Yeah. 
Mm. Oh, geez. Wow. So the town supposedly have a festival this year for this kind of handcrafted boats, but obviously this year is canceled, so we couldn't see much but these two. You got your strap wrapped around your arm. Oh yeah, you do. Oh. Because they don't waste anything, right? In animals, mm. uh, which is kind of cool. You filming me? Yeah. yeah you're okay, you're explaining. Too, you're uh, explaining everything. Yeah, so. I was just explaining like what what's in there, what to expect. Right? Yeah. Tea. You said tea, right? There's tea. Yeah. It's the the whole grocery section's cool in general, though. Mm. You're gonna find a lot of stuff made out of bone. What is this? Uh, it's for it's cutting knife? up a uh, seal. Ah, the seal. The, the like leather of the seal, right? Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's very interesting. Yeah, this is actually one of the shirts I'm wearing. Oh, you wanted to watch? Oh, yeah, no, yeah, exactly. So, Jeff took me to this uh, reserved uh, native uh, shop. They have a lot of handmade. Uh, handcrafted material here so it's a really good place to buy a unique gift or souvenirs and downstairs they also have a museum you should check out i couldn't take a picture of it uh, because they forbid uh, taking a picture and video but also there's a art gallery behind this shop too you can purchase the original painting right there all these soft leather yeah, I guess at South Mock these are called the uh, Mock Locks or Mock Yogs? Mock Locks. Mock Locks, is that it? Well, we we all were for South Mock at one point, that's why. Yeah. Yes. That's interesting. These three shelves are the men. The men's here? Okay. Yeah, this perfect. wall is the ladies. Yeah, yeah that's right. <laughs> that's for the ladies. It's way more colorful, too. Well, the men have three colors. This style comes in. 26 colors. Yeah, that's that's crazy. Uh, I had a little... Yeah, it's actually really cool. Yeah, I remember that's That's cool. If you go from the other side, you get a better view, actually. Dude, look at this guy here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because uh, remember our old apartment we had one of these like this? Yeah, it was from here. Oh, it was from here. Yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah. It was a gift that I got Sarah. Wait, didn't you have that on your other couch now, on your sofa? No, it's still with Sarah. It's still with Sarah. Yeah. You'll see the army boxes. Yeah, well, the thing with their uh, the reserves and stuff like that is when they kill an animal, they just pay every part of it. That's like a big part of it. Mm -hmm. There's not extra No, I was just seeing this bear is like almost like a baby bear. Oh, I don't know if that's a bear. Wildflower honeys, big gems. You put this in like a foil and put it in the fire, and it pops in the popcorn. Oh, really? That's interesting. So they just dry the dry the corn itself. Yeah, that's something. The cool scar. I was gonna say because the deer skull is uh, 500. This is cheaper and it's like half the size. Mm. I'm curious what the animal is. Is this? I guess it's the condition.
Yeah, I think we have parked for a reason. North that way? I don't know if it's north, but there's an arrow that's pointing yeah, out. Yeah, it's probably north. Yeah. Don't slip. And this was my favorite part of the whole trip because we took some uh, astrophotography. It's really hard to take a photo in the city, so it was very good opportunity. And it was rare for me. I see what you mean, man. Like the stars are gone. Yeah, cause I. The cloud over Castle. Exactly. Oh, well, you're getting a video. I can barely see you on the <laughs> um, camera. Ah. Oh wow. Shit, my face. <laughs> yeah, Your eyes. Well, I probably look like a crazy now. person in there for a second. If I go close because of this light, I can barely see the person's face. See that? <laughs> yeah, you can. Dude. Yeah, kind of. It looks like a, you know, like a something. night documentary. Yeah, not even that, uh, which is a movie. Fuck. Blair Witch Project. Oh, oh yeah, it does. <laughs> Just the normal thing. Okay, is oh, there? Shit. I don't know. I don't can, know. can I see the flashlight? <laughs> oh yeah, you shit! Did you hear it? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, that's been it for today. Uh, thanks for watching the review of the Kawartha Lake. I'm not sure if that's actually content review, but all right. Anyways, later. Bye.